Hello everyone and I welcome you to the gospel with Ishmael and uh, I do believe you might have already heard uh, that different things that are done as Christians you know there are things also called or referred to as interceding for others you know praying for others you don't pray for them I give them you away they don't deliver they die of course they will die but their blood will be in your hands so beside that the bottom the main thing that I, main point that I'm trying to make is that there are people who are facing different things in the world. You know, if we, we we will be able, if it was possible, and the Lord just shows us everything that is happening in the world right now, you will see that people are facing different things. Some of them, you won't even believe how is this happening? How are they surviving? That is why I want to pray that sometimes when God gives you weight, you will say this, so pray for that. It might not be happening to you or your family or your relatives, friend or so, someone close that you know, but sometimes it's good to pray for anyone who is there. That grace will just go all over and God will deliver, will save, will redeem someone based on that prayer that you have made. You'll be like, a prayer was given. So who needs this prayer? Who should my grace go upon? And he chooses and the Lord will reward you for it, for obeying. Therefore, anyone that is to be taken away, without the enemy's plan, that they won't be coming back home. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray that may the Lord prolong. May the Lord cancel every plans of the enemy to take them away from their home. I pray in whatever form, God knows well. May God protect them. May God protect your family. May God protect you as well. What if it's you? So that's why I pray that in Jesus' mighty name, May God protect everyone that is to be victimized in this manner. In Jesus' name, amen. My details are on the comment section below. See you next time.